Meep meep. Hello, this is Stampy, and welcome to a Minecraft Let's Play video. Today, I'm playing a round of Hunger Games on a map called Beep Beep. <laughs> this is a um a Coyote and Roadrunner themed map. Uh, it was built by Castle Crafters and Team Ripples. Uh, it's called Beep Beep, as I said. Uh, here are oh no, here are the rules down here. Pretty standard stuff, which I never bother reading. Uh, here are some here are some comments. Here are some reviews from some other people, I guess. Um, very nice. And uh, over here are all of the builders. So let me just uh, pan across here so you can see all of them. And over here is a load of cheese. <laughs> anyway, let's go up and uh, play the game then, shall we? I'm um, playing with a, a group of friends. And oh, hello, hello. Oh, what you what you're doing shaking those things around? <laughs> They're for sitting on, not shaking around. Anyway, uh, today in this video, I'm being joined by Long. Shop, Miss Pink Mermaid, Lime Maker, Rosie, Mini God, Daddy O, and Super Sheep. <laughs> and uh, once everyone's ready, uh, they're going to hop inside of the pods. Uh, in this, is this is this actually a big lump of cheese, uh, or is it? I don't know what this is supposed to be. Actually, this big spongy thing. Uh, there it says a uh, bird sea. Oh, is it a big? Bird see? Thing? I don't even know what this is supposed to be. Uh, but there you can see, <laughs> there's Roadrunner uh, looking at us backwards between his legs. And over there, uh, you can see the massive big coyote uh, that has gone and smashed uh, into the into the wall over there. And I've not seen this map properly. Uh, this is literally the only bit I've seen is this area here. So uh, we're going to go and have a look around during the game. And uh, because it's quite big, uh, we're going to start off with gamer tags off. And then uh, once it's down to only two people left, I'm going to switch gamer tags back on. Uh, otherwise, it might just take a long time trying to find the final person. So hopefully, I am going to be in that final two and uh, be in that situation. Uh, but what I'm going to do... And I'm going to very quickly cut ahead in the video uh, until everyone is ready and inside of their pods and then we can begin the game. Okay, everyone should now be ready to rock and roll. So let's begin the Hunger Games. If I pull this lever, oh, we got lifted up and now we can go and run to the chest. And oh, I got a sword right at the beginning. It's always nice, a splash potion of something or other. Uh, another wooden sword, oh, a golden apple. Oh, look, a, an iron helmet as well. A compass, I don't really care about that. Oh, a load of free seeds that are at the top there. Brilliant, that's exactly what I wanted. What was that potion? A potion of Slowness. Okay, so um, <laughs> it seems quite fitting for this map that you might want to slow someone down. And oh, a, po a potion of poison. I love myself a good potion of potion. A potion of potion? <laughs> I don't know what accent that was there. All right, let's go wander off then. Let's try and go in a direction uh, that no one else is going in. There seems to be people going over there. Uh, let's go. Oh, I can see one person running off in that direction and someone running off over there. Uh, if I go through here and maybe go left, or is that where they're all going to go? Oh, no. <laughs> I wanted to go where like no one else had gone, but it seems everyone's gone in the same direction. Right, let's go have a look around this way shall we uh, there seems to be crafting tables all over the place uh, there's a chest up there i guess if i uh, jump my way up here i might be able to try and grab this chest i'm already get quite hungry actually to be honest i got a few carrots i guess that's kind of good timing <laughs> and uh, i got a, a a stick as well so maybe if i get two pieces of iron or maybe a diamond i might be able to make myself a better sword there's lots of uh, hidden chests all the way around here uh, inside of these uh, big canyon uh, canyons and look i got a, a bow actually that's quite good as well as some leggings so i can try and cover myself up a little bit so i won't get so chilly and i got a load of um uh, seeds i think some people have been leaving a trail of seeds behind them i think i picked up <laughs> Uh, a whole load of their free seeds. And look, there's a chest all the way back here. Hopefully this one's going to have something good in because it's kind of quite out the way. Oh, a chest play, another bow. I don't really need another bow, seeing as I just had one. But I got some bottles of enchanting. And oh no, Rosie hit the ground too hard. Uh, because it's so early on, uh, I'm assuming she's gonna she's gonna be able to to carry on. I think it would be a bit harsh if we say uh, she's helped the game already for hitting the ground too hard. But I'm gonna take it as a warning. And oh no, oh no, oh, 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 oh. That was terrifying! <laughs> oh, I got an iron sword though from it. That was genuinely terrifying. I should just wait here and just wait for people to drop down and then when they drop down, just take them out as they land. That was awesome though. That was really cool. I honestly thought that was me being taken out. <laughs> right, take, have a listen out. If you hear someone else drop down, I'm going to run down and try and catch them because they're going to still be weak after going through the lava. That would be a really cool place to wait for a trap. But I think it would also be really boring, so I'm not going to do that. Right, where where has this led me to then? Shall I go up or down? Oh look, there's a chest up the top up there, and uh, I've got, I got my iron sword out of that. That was that wasn't too bad. And oh, Daddy O was slain by a slime. So far, two people have been taken out. None of them by other players, all by either dropping or by a slime. <laughs> right, I'm nearly up that place up there. 
Uh, let me try and make my way up here. Oh, can I make my way to the top? And there we go. I managed to get this chest. And all oh, I got uh, an iron helmet. I'm actually doing really good. I'm actually, I, I think I've already got an iron helmet, actually, don't I? Oh, I already had one, so it's a bit of a waste of time for me. But at least I've stopped um, uh, anyone else from being able to, to get the helmet, I guess, is the is the only good thing. And uh, let me try and make my way back down here. Oh, is this where I dropped through then? Okay, so there's more stuff around here. Uh, a bottle of enchanting there, uh, so I could try and get my levels up. And I got some booties. Not the best booties, but booties nonetheless. Right, let me just splash this now and get it out of the way. Like, I've got my enchanted golden apple there. And uh, I guess if I go back this way, uh, this is me going back the, the way I came. And I think loads of people just lagged out. Right, so I'm going to very quickly uh, try and invite them all back in. And uh, then we can carry on playing. Okay, I've just invited everyone back in the game, so we can now go and carry on. I'm going to very, very carefully try and make my way back out of that death trap. <laughs> and I go and try and hunt some people down. I'm feeling good now. Look, check me out. I look like someone who's ready to take some people out. So all I need to do is run around as quick as I can. Meep, meep. Meep, meep. Where is everyone? Meep, meep. <laughs> oh, dear. Let's go. Let's go and, like, go in the complete opposite direction uh, from where I went at the beginning of the map. Then, oh, look. I've come out here. This is, like, behind. This is where the uh, where the uh, the Roadrunner bird was looking through its legs, I guess. <laughs> so let's go and head over in this direction. And look, there's, there's another coyote over there just strapped onto, like, uh, a massive rocket or something over in that direction. This map does look so cool, doesn't it? <laughs> right, let's go and look in this chest. Oh, there's things here that I've not looked in. A uh, potion of slowness uh, could be quite handy. Is that, like, a another iron helmet oh no that's the one i had anyway all right let's get this uh, potion of slowness and let's put it next to the um uh, the potion of poison and so i can just go and throw all of those okay now that's what have i got now i got is that two slowness i got two slowness and poison so uh, if someone comes at me i can just slow them down and poison them and then that way if they try and run away when they're poisoned i can just go and try and chase them down and like another stone sword i'll uh, grab that just so no one else can grab it and some more bottles of enchanting. And were there, were there enchanting tables in the beginning of the map? Oh, look, there's someone right there. There's someone right there. I didn't even see them at first. I didn't even see them. Right, let's try and get them with slowness if I can. Then that way they're not going to be able to run away. There we go. I got them with slowness. I got them with slowness, but they're trying to fight back. They're trying to fight back. Well, let's try and use poison if I can. Oh, no, I, got, I did another slowness again. Oh, no, this is going bad. This is going bad. Let's have the uh, the golden apple if I can. Let's get my health back up. There we go. That's going to put my health completely up. And there we go. That saved my life. And oh, no, am I getting hit from behind? Oh, no, we're good. We're good. We're good. I panicked then. I did that really bad. I did that really, really bad. If I didn't have that uh, golden apple, that would have been me taken out. But in the uh, yeah, but the way it did work out is was I was able to to take out Miss Pink Mermaid. So let's go and uh, hide back here a little bit, and uh, let's go try and have a look through what I've got. And that um. That uh, golden apple is really good. It was like a, an enchanted golden apple. So it gave me like regeneration for ages. So that uh, really did save my life then. I wasted all of my potions though, uh, but I'm still feeling pretty good. I've still got uh, my pockets full of seeds. <laughs> so I can use them if someone comes after me. Maybe distract them by throwing seeds in their eyes. And look, there's a chest up here. I might be able to have a look in. See if this has been taken. Oh no, there's still stuff in there, but not... Uh, really anything that I particularly want. Right, let's try and let's try and climb up here then, shall we? Oh, it's so sad. It's going to be really slow trying to climb my way up. Right, let's gradually try and trudge my way up. I always find it's good to, to get the high ground on maps like this, because uh, then we can look over the map. And I don't actually think there's many people left. It's just me, uh, Lion Maker, and Longshot left. So uh, as soon as there's only two people left, as I said, uh, we will be switching gamer tags on. And I thought that was someone there then, uh, but it's only a skeleton, right? I should uh, be able to deal with the skeleton easy enough. Let's try and charge in and dodge its arrows and take him out there we go it may be only a googly but a kill's a kill <laughs> and i got my xp up a little bit more i could try and uh, get some more bottles of enchanting and put uh, my xp up even more if i wanted to and my pockets are getting completely filled up now i just want to make sure no one's sneaking up on me right let's finally get rid of some of these seeds that i don't need then and some string and bones and oh i can see someone can you see that in the bottom left of the screen can you see that person running around down there <laughs> Look, look, down there. Meep, 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 meep. <laughs> oh, it makes me laugh. Right, so I got a uh, another potion of poison, which um I didn't do too great with my one last time, but hopefully I can use this one a little bit better. And it looks like there's some um, rather difficult parkour uh, to actually get inside of the rocket. So I might go and give that a go. I'm going to have a, a bit of food at hand. I'm going to have a little carrot before I jump up. A carrot for courage I'm going to have. <laughs> and then I'm going to go and try and face this uh, parkour. Right, it seems to be... It seems to be easy enough, uh, but I always do uh, rubbish at parkour when I'm under pressure, and I do feel a little bit under pressure right now. I'm doing okay so far, though. If I jump up this way, and here we go. I've got inside of the exploding rocket, and I have found... Oh, an iron inger, and oh, I've got some... I think these are better boots than I had before, so uh, I think that might have been worth coming up here, but... Uh, there we go. Look, I got some really good armor now. I'm like full chainmail with an iron helmet. Right, let's go try and take some people out then, shall we? And uh, I got some more bottles of enchanting. 
And so if I put that there, I can go and splash this. And then if I go back to the middle, I'm going to go and see if there was a um, if there was a, an enchantment table there. And then I might be able to enchant my iron sword, which would be amazing. All right, let me try and gradually make my way down here without hurting myself too much. And uh, is there an easier way to get down? Or should I just, oh, let's just go down the way I came up. At least I know that way's safe. I know the way I got up was safe. So let's just go back down this way. And uh, let's go on the hunt after a line maker and long shot, shall we? So there's two kitty cats, uh, armor cat, line maker is a lion and a long shot is a bear so let's see who's gonna win <laughs> maybe we should uh, team up with line maker maybe the, the cat should stick together and look looks like there's um there's like a tnt explosion here should i try blowing it up should i try blowing up that tnt do you reckon it's gonna reveal something well if i try and climb my way up here let's see if there's like a button i can press uh, to be able to blow it up uh, I don't know how I actually get up here. Can I jump up like this? Oh, this is really awkward to do, getting up these ladders. I'm rubbish at ladder parkour, as you can see. I'm just scared someone's going to sneak up on me as I'm trying to do this. You've got to kind of like jump out and then back in again. Or maybe going up here might be easier. Then I can jump up to that one and then up to this one. There we go. I've got up to the top. Caution may explode. Right. Oh, there's pressure plates. Right. Go in the pressure plates and then run away. Run away, run away, run away, run away. Oh. Is this going to be a, man a massive anticlimax? It didn't even blow up anyway. Ah, and oh no. Oh, I just walked into a cactus. <laughs> that was the biggest anticlimax in the world. It didn't blow up. And then I walked into a cactus. <laughs> right, let's try and take out some of these googlies then. Uh, this is the kind of the direction I saw someone running in. Uh, but that was a little while ago. So they could have kind of uh, gone off anywhere since then. But I'm still going to have my, my wits about me. I don't want anyone uh, to be sneaking up on me. That's always the way to win. It doesn't matter about who's got the best stuff. Uh, you always just want to be sneaking up on someone else. And oh look. Longshot was slain by Lion Maker, which means it is now down uh, to just a 1v1. So that means I'm going to have to turn gamer tags on. I kind of want to get somewhere safe to do it without any creepers nearby. As if I go to uh, option setting... Uh, options in game gamer tags are now on so what this means is I'm going to be able to see him from much further away and it means he can't be as sneaky as he might have otherwise been so uh, I should hopefully be able to spot him and I can't actually see an enchantment table anywhere over here so uh, I guess I'm just going to wander around the rest of the map I've not looked over on this corner yet so I'm going to go check over here I see if there's any chests that people haven't looked in and uh, also try and find an enchantment table or a line maker which would be <laughs> uh, just as good but he's probably got some good stuff now though because I think he's uh, been able to take out quite a lot of people uh, so he's probably been stealing all of their loot so uh, I'm going to expect uh, quite a, a difficult fight when I go after him and look there are some there are some empty chests over here look more bottles of enchantment as well I really could um I really could have, have a, quite a lot of uh, levels if I splash all of these. Uh, I'm almost up to, to five levels now, which uh, isn't bad at all for, for a round of Hunger Games. Uh, so I think I'm definitely going to look for an enchantment table. And there he is! There he is! I can see him through the wall, right? Let's see if I can go and make my way to him. Uh, there's a gold helmet there. I really don't need that, but uh, these arrows will be good. There we go. I've got 26 arrows. So if I fight him long range, uh, I might have uh, quite a good chance. I don't know what sword he's going to have or anything yet, though. And oh, he's right here. He's right here. He's coming after me. There's a zombie here, though. I think I'm going to have to deal with the zombie first. Oh, no. Right. Let's take out the zombie. Oh, oh he splashed me with something. He splashed me with harming, I think that is. Right. Let's try and back off if I can. I've got my potion of uh, poison. Uh, so if he runs too close, I can try and poison him and try and take him out that way. I'm going to have something to eat and uh, try and get my hunger up and then just keep running away. Oh, he's getting so close, though. He's getting so close. There we go. I've splashed him with poison. I've splashed him with poison. And now if I sh keep shooting him back with arrows, and then I might can hurt him a bit. If I keep shooting him with arrows again, he's hurt by the poison. He's got to be so weak. And there we go. I managed to do it. I managed to win. Woo! <laughs> that was so close. <laughs> so close. I'm like two and a half hearts. I did it, though. I did it. Did you see? Meep, meep. Meep, meep. Meep, meep. Meep, meep. <laughs> right into another cactus. <laughs> I don't even care. <laughs> oh, dear. That was good. That was a nice epic fight at the end. I thought I was going to do rubbish. <laughs> I always panic and I just press the wrong buttons on the controller and I always make the absolute worst decisions <laughs> whenever I'm in like a, a combat situation like that. But I did it. I came up on top and I won. GG, Lion Maker. Good game. Well played. I think that uh, he had a very good game as well there. So hopefully he's not too disheartened. <laughs> anyway, this was a, an absolutely awesome map. I feel like I only scratched the surface of seeing all of the little hidden bits and all of the uh, sneaky extras. Uh, so if you would like to download and play this map for yourself, I'll be leaving it as a link in the description. And it's raining. Oh, that's no good, is it? <laughs> and I'll also be leaving as a link in the description uh, the channel of the builders, uh, as well as all of the other people I was playing with, including this kitty cat up here. You can't hide from me, Lion Maker. You can't hide from me. GG, Lion Maker. GG, GG. And look, there was an enchantment table up here after all. Oh, well, doesn't matter. Doesn't matter now. <laughs>
Ah, uh, that's the end of this video here. I want to thank you all very much for watching, and I will see you later. Meep, 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 meep. <laughs>